Hey Retro, it's Viola. Um, thanks so much. It was good chatting with you yesterday, I think, or the day before. And thanks for clicking on this video. So yes, I found your site. And I just, I'm just i going to go over a couple things that you can do to start bringing in more clients or just to head in the direction of what it is that you want to do, right? So the first thing I want to mention is that um, you definitely want to add a click to call button, like how you have the book now here, but make sure that it's um it's optimized for the mobile for people's cell phones because 90% of the time that's where somebody's going to be looking for you and you want them to be able to uh you want that to be pretty clear as soon as they land on your page they could click and they're immediately in contact with you or whoever you have to answer the phone right um i love this little uh, logo here that's pretty dope right other than that definitely content so you want to add at least 1500 words of content onto your home page the reason why i say that is because although google doesn't care how your website looks they do care about the information that's on it so when somebody goes to google and they type in loctician atlanta right google's job is to put them in front of the article that has the most words on it and typically these articles that live on the home page have at least 1500 to 2000 words of content on this first page so you want to increase that um, home page of yours upwards to at least a thousand to fifteen hundred words of content. Um, I, I pulled up one of your competitors because when you put in Loctician Atlanta, the uh, the first uh, organic competitor that pops up is Shea Locks. I don't know if you're familiar with them, but I pulled them up. Here's their site right here. They don't have fifteen hundred to two thousand words of content um, visible. However, they're ranking they're ranking on the first page so that just tells me that there's some opportunity here where you can outrank them um when it comes to just the content the other thing i want to talk about are citations so right underneath the the map or the map pack whatever you want to call it right there are always like three businesses that populate on the first page and i'm sure you know if you click right here there's about like a hundred or 200 other businesses that are all doing locks in the same area but only three are on the first page and you and i both know nobody goes past page one for anything when it comes to google so the strategy to win here is to find out exactly how many citations these people have so a citation is simply your business name address and phone number located in different directories or throughout different directories across the World Wide Web, such as like uh, Facebook, Yelp, Yellow Pages, Angie's List, Instagram, um, White Pages, Bing, like these are all directories. Um, and you want to see how many these people have. When you find out how much they have, let's say Lock Life by Kai or Key has 70 citations well you want to add another 20 or 30 on top of that so you know you're outranking them month after month after month right and that's how you're going to win by being in this area here lastly i'm going to go over our the is is what's in the organic area and that's everything down here in order to get ranked and that has everything to do with backlinks so i pulled up your business here we go and this is in a tool that I use called Arras, and it allows me to just see the back end of a website and see what's going on and how everything is working for you, right? So obviously there's not a lot going on here, but that's nothing to scoff at. There's so many locticians that don't even have a website, yet alone have any domains linking back to them. So a referring do domain or a backlink is simply where you are on a website and there's a link on that site where if you click it, it takes you to another website. And in turn, it adds power from one site to the next. So backlinks are super powerful and so important. So I pulled up backlinks on this particular site here. I'm gonna go from the beginning with Shaylocks, as you see there right up here. So um, I pulled up their site here so we could see they have 39 websites linking back to them 138 times. So the strategy will be is to go in and see exactly what sites are working for them, what sites are giving them power. And if I were you, I would go and ask for a link on those same sites so that I can start to get the same type of power to your site. Um, just so you know, not all backlinks are created equal. So let's say, for example, if somebody, if you did a uh, hair for... I don't know, one of your celebrity clients, right? And they say, you know what, you know what, Retro, you cool. I'm gonna go ahead and put you on my music site, 
right? Because I'm going to, you know, that way I'll give you some power. Well, Google knows that you don't, you don't sell music for a living, right? So Google is not going to give you credit for it or as much credit for it as if it was another uh, relevant website, something that has to do with locks or retwists or hair, something along those lines. And the number to look at that with is like this right here. This is, you want this number to be high and that's how you know if it's going to give you some power. Like you see this, this is a bridal website. So that has something to do, you know, it could come along the lines of hair. So that has more power than something like, um, like Georgia search us, you know, that's zero. So it just depends, but definitely go in and find out what links are working for them, ask for one, and then get it on your page. And last thing I'm gonna go over with you, Retro, I I'm sorry, I didn't mean for this to be so long, but this is a good one. As soon as my computer loads, I wanna talk about keywords. Keywords are super, super important. All right, so for example, these are all the keywords that are being indexed for Shaylock's page. And if you take a look, for example, right here, Loctician Atlanta, it says here that 600 people are looking for that particular keyword per month. They get 89 out of that 600, and they're in the number two spot on Google for it. They just moved up to the number two spot. Looks like they were number three, right? And then you go down a little more. If you look here, Locks Atlanta, 150 people look for that per month. They get 52 calls just from that particular keyword, and they're in the number one spot on Google. You see, so, and the list goes on and on. I try to stay away from near me because that could be anywhere, Alaska, that could be Trinidad. So, you know, that's why those numbers are astronomically high. But if you look at like specifically Atlanta or the times whenever you're in Florida, et cetera, you want to take these keywords and that's what you want to have on all, in all that content that I'm talking about on this home page. And you even want to save your photos as those keywords so that way people can find you know when somebody searches for that keyword your photo can populate and it'll take them straight to your site so that's all i have for you retro i hope you found this super helpful um give me some feedback let me know what you thought about it um i'd love to know if you thought it was terrible or if you think you could actually put it to some use and if you want to partner on this i can also speak with you about that further Right. But other than that, it was good chatting with you for real. And I look forward to hearing from you soon. Take care.